Joe Cornish. Uh, I am in Snowdonia in northwestern Wales. There is a kind of backdrop of, of ideas that I've worked with for 35 or 40 years now and the, uh, th that I'm still repeating or, or revisiting. Uh, and in a sense, there isn't a specific solution that I'm looking for. But what, I, what, I, what I'm after is, is an instinctive uh, uh, response. So I would typically use a, a small camera, uh, like the little Sony RX100 or uh, my phone, uh, to visualize uh, something that I feel has promise, that shows that the kind of the elements that I, I, I'm really, really responding to strongly, um, whether, whether they're quite abstract um, you know, or, or quite pictorial. Uh, and as in the case with uh, Trafan, I actually I looked at three different opportunities and then I just went between them uh, on, on the small camera, like a sketching process. And in the end, you have to settle on one of them. Uh, one was a, there's a long strand of, of water moving through the uh, lower third of the composition uh, and a lot of darkness. And I, I found that slightly menacing. Um, and I quite liked it, but it, it wasn't how I felt, I guess. Um, then in another, there was a sort of series of triangles um, of surfaces uh, that was really interesting. And I, I, I thought that was really promising. I almost went for that idea. But the final one had combined elements of curved energy that I felt reflected how I get, I mean, I didn't think about it at the time. It was instinctive. You just see, and that's the one that you like the most. It appeals to you most. And I, I think ultimately photography and art generally is about you know, uh, looking inside in order to express what you see outside.